winner this weekend, and, and no big shock anywhere. Transformers, Dark of the Moon, no big surprise whatsoever that it dominated. However, it is now the highest grossing 4th of July movie of all time, $97 million. Uh, it's the third best worldwide debut of all time, around the year. The movie's big uh, on CG, but the actors didn't want to leave all the cool stuff to computers. In fact, I talked with Shia LaBeouf and said, didn't you want the computers to do some of it? Didn't you scream at your director? Take a listen. You commit. No you matter do. how small or how large the yeah, budget, yeah, you yeah. commit. You, so you're not someone that would turn to Michael Bay and say, Michael, you're killing us. Can't you do this with CG? No, you, no, you no. You seem no, dedicated no. to being in yeah, that shot. Yeah. I, I'm, I'm overcommitted, actually. Mike didn't, you know, I just went to the point where Michael would be like, you got to slow down, dude. You, you know, you look like a heroin addict. You look like you're smoking <laughs> crack, you know? Right. Um, but, like, me and Josh get in, and we're, we're in it all day, you know? It's very physical. You can see a face vibrating when a heart rate is at a certain level, you know? You can tell the difference between somebody spraying water on a face, you know, as opposed right. to somebody, you know, going through it. Mike likes us going through it, you know? And he lets us, too. As as you know on some levels fun and exciting it's yeah. still at the end of the day it's it's work was there ever a moment on the set you thought man I, I can't wait till my next romantic comedy nope never felt that way ever in life never I don't think I'll ever be in a romantic comedy I'd rather eat a car piece by piece Ooh, wow, <laughs> wow. Yeah, there are people Tell that can arrange really that feel. you know while that <laughs> sounded random it was also a nice segue speaking of cars cars two finished uh, number two uh, this weekend it slowed down a little bit did you plan bit. that not really, I just thought about it just now. <laughs> Cars 2 slowed down. Transformers, uh, despite Transformers, Cars 2 raked in another $25 million. It's almost at $100 million gross already. Bad Teachers rounded out the top three, bringing in over just $14 million at the box office. If you check out Mark at the Movies, our big special, you can mm -hmm. find it now at GoodDaySacramento.com. Uh, we talked to some area teachers. We sent a gaggle of teachers to go see Bad Teacher to get their review. Sad is uh, now, back to Hangover 2. So, Courtney, I, I'm guessing that's not your cup of tea. You haven't seen yeah, it. Yeah, not so much. Did anybody see Hangover 2? Anybody? Anybody? <laughs> my, my thing is, Hangover 2, no one would say it's not a good movie had they not seen number one. It's just not quite as good as no. number one. Uh, okay. Regardless, something bizarre has happened with director Todd Phillips. If we can pull the picture up right now, he saved Paris Hilton's life. Really? Evidently, at a nightclub. She needed mouth-to-mouth -mouth <laughs> resuscitation. Yes. And that's director yes. Todd Phillips, who's about my age with Paris Hilton at really? this nightclub. Wow. I don't Wowzers. know. I, I'm, not, I'm assuming it's mouth-to-mouth -mouth resuscitation. They may have been, you know, exchanging saliva just for grins. Weird! Wow. It wasn't a one-night stand. The two have only eyes for each other, their publicists are saying. They're hooking up. But why would a brilliant director like that, one of the funniest people on this planet, be hooking up with that vacant, vacuous, <laughs> disease-infested... She is a business mogul. She's, yes. Yes. She is, she's a mogul. She's, she's absolutely a business mogul. Wow. She is. <laughs> On the talk the other day, and I was just—I was just about to say it was her mom funny. Were on yes. the talk. Yeah, it was funny. Because I know our audience is a little bit broader <laughs> and a little bit more family on holidays, I'll refrain from any further comment okay. about Paris Hilton. That's so good of you. But I did talk to you? Todd Phillips about what he was thinking. Take and? a look. The Hangover, the first one, really was an aggressive comedy, and I think we had to stay with that attitude and Come on, get maybe up. more so oh. on the sequel, and um, that was our goal. Where are we? You're gonna freak out, but it's gonna be okay. What's, is it my teeth? Congratulations, and you sick bastard. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> That's not exactly the soundbite I was asking for. <laughs> That was something totally Sorry, different. Was, I hate when that happens. But anyway, that was Todd Phillips. That's the guy currently trading saliva and DNA and other things with Paris. How Hilton. nice. Good times, good times. Okay, 619.